today of DJ Chark coming in. Bryce Young has it after a great fake. Open short. Trying to work is Miles Sanders. Low throw and it's incomplete. Out of timeouts. Sanders setting up a third and long. Four down at 11. Long wrapped up. Down he goes to the table. There's Caden Ellis. He's going to walk up into it, and because of that, they don't account for him in the pass protection. They account Everybody coming in to the rescue. Gibbs, good job on the run defense. Five-minute drive with its ninth play here. On second and long. Goff, sidearm sling for Laporta, and Caden Ellis immediately coming in. Went to Greater Atlanta Christian in Norcross. Playing against his hometown team. Goff is looking to load up another one. Instead, goes under into Sam Laporta today. Yeah, no, I mean that's just right. Idaho, stay low. Same shoulder, same foot. Drives. Oh yeah, I'll throw him Man. around. I love it. I love it. Physical, physical in the middle of the field. That's what we thought we'd see today. Now third down and ten. Four man rush again. Goff standing, delivering low to Laporta. Seventh overall in total D last year, up to seventh so far this season through four weeks. Big improvement. And Stroud able to complete it. Just not with great field position. Stroud will hand it off. Damian Pierce straight ahead. And he gets four. And we go back out to... On first down, they pass with Howell rolling right, dumps it down, and it's complete at the 25. Go! Routed Rodriguez again, and this time the Falcons were ready for it. Looks like a hole, I guess is what you're saying. Yeah, it looks like it, smells like it, you know, and tastes like it. It's probably a hole. He's just so good with his hands. It's just, yeah, the two linebackers. Let's meet at the running back. Landman right there. Cade Nell containing Baker Mayfield. And there's that annoying run that uh, gets them out of that. That's what Ryan Nielsen, their coordinator, said. And they will run it on first down. No surprise there. So, guys, they don't uh, entertain your thoughts of vote. Uh, was on. Showing pressure, bringing pressure. The blitz is picked up, buying some time for Levis. And he'll check it down to Chig Okonkwo. Tajay Spears. Play action, under pressure. Did and uh, did like a, a lot of job. folks. Derrick Henry was, didn't have the shot down the field that he might have wanted. So he was able to, what they call, dirt that ball right at the feet of Derrick Henry and said, Levis. Hopkins caught underneath of the cross. Fell game. And you hear him at the line of scrimmage, looking at the defense, understanding what they're doing, and then getting them in the right play. Really a good command so far. Third and goal. Jaron Hall is going to run. Arizona scrambling out, and this is it. I mean, even corners in this legal tattoo you, and you see, looks like, a, or something like, yeah, that. something of that nature. Cam Akers has it. <laughs> he works his way to the 50, and then is shoved back by Kate Nellis. Where is Hawkinson? As Madison is the bottom of your screen, Hawkinson in the slot. Dobbs looks and knocked away. Kate, oh, Kate Nellis does a really nice job, just right here, one on one with Hawkinson. Good matchup. That's where you want to go, but just look at an undercut. Teen yard infraction. First and ten. As they work from the 34-yard line. Murray puts his back into it. Fires. It's caught by Wilson right at the 30-yard line. This line that is really beat up right now. James Conner trying to fight his way back to the line of scrimmage. And trying to resuscitate their year. Murray on second down, and they give chase and get to the quarterback. It's Ellis again. Load this side. Look at how many rushers. They're just going to overwhelm this side away from the running back. 
and really Kyler Murray has no chance. So that's that's what I was. You felt it coming. I felt it coming. Yeah, the stars so far for those Arizona. So here we go from the 25-yard line. Saints begin with a Camaro run that will lose yards. It is the old. They think a chance for him to make even another leap with Michael Thomas out here down the stretch. Camaro with a first down run. Got met in the backfield by Caden Ellis. And, and Caden Ellis is going to beat the blocks because these guys are coming, and it's a gap scheme wraparound. And watch this play by 55. He gets there. It, it, that is blocked correctly. That That's going to be... Car on time, incomplete, out in front of the Car, dumping it for Camara, incomplete with the defense from the field, and sometimes you're going to have some pass interference. Let's see how Caden Ellis does. Sure looks like he got there. I don't, I don't know if they're considering that ball uncatchable, but boy, that, that could have been pass interference. Third down and six. Carr retreating. Pressure. Kept it alive. Derek Carr floats one for Williams, who's got no shot. And the bad part for New Orleans is, you know, they just had their bye last week. And, and how important that was, they talked to us about getting the guys healthy. Page the reigning NFC Defensive We're Player 19. of the Week. <laughs> so trickery from the Jets, the fake to Cook. And they get it into the hands of Gibson. Third down at seven for Boyle and the Jets. Pass incomplete. Fourth quarter of that game against the Jets, so some key pieces that they are missing. With a bit of a high snap, Baker Fields on second and eight goes through his reads, completes over the middle. Snap takes it away, but the protection allowed Mayfield to get it to his second receiver. Here's Rashad White trying to slip a tackle, but unable to break it to four second seven. Just a tremendous effort. Handoff here as Edmonds is dragged down by Ellis, who's been all over the place for the rest of this game. Second and five. And they went after Street because of Brady Jarrett. You're exactly. Jarrett, that devastating ACL injury earlier in the season. Planet defense. First and ten as they work from the 26. Mayfield protected. He's going to take his shot. Far side end zone and incomplete. First step by Ellis. <laughs> Ellis. Ellis having himself a game, isn't he? I mean, they've attacked him multiple. Keep it on the ground. Caden Ellis chases down Miles Sanders and drills him. Support. Yeah, one of the things you're going to find when you play this team, look at the amount of guys that are in the box. Why? Because they're not threatened by the quarterback in the passing game right now. Sanders. Nice job by Keenan Ellis. Disengages from his blocker. It's all about the hands, and all you have to do is watch him right here. Watch him use his hands to get off the block right there. That is Bozeman, the center. And off for Taylor. Wow, what a play by Caden Ellis. Well, Caden Ellis is just going to slide across. He's going to follow the slide guy. The tight end slide across. You see Granson right there? Well, he just mirrored him like he was almost in man-to-man -man coverage and slid out the backside. They've got Goodson in on this third down. A little orbit motion from Downs. Minshew with that pocket collapsing. This is what Atlanta was finishing. Well, here, here is uh, here's our guy right here, Caden Ellis. And remember, his father, Luther Ellis, was a defensive lineman, so he's got some of those natural pass rush skills and just slings down Minshew. But really nice job and still only rushing four guys but bringing a linebacker so you're changing up the people who are coming after the quarterback and we'll keep it on the ground with sermon and bud dupree was right there ready and waiting the call makes me feel like they knew they were going to go for it on fourth down watch him defeat the block of the tight end coming across see the quick swim right there throw him into the ground and go off and make a play on the running back. Just, I mean, you can't play it any better. That's the fifth Atlanta sack today, the second for Harrison. Minshew throws for Pierce, and he cannot make the play. A lot of pressure coming from Atlanta. They brought the house.
post that time. Some heat. Yeah, they were bringing heat off the edge. And then watch Cade Nellis right here. The linebacker position. Fake the heat. That's to get one-on-ones with everybody else. And then he gets the tip on the shallow cross right there. They create the play clock lead. Gets the snap. Hands it off. Up the middle. Johnson, again, just needed one yard. Didn't need to get all the way in. Caden Ellis. On third down. Field doesn't have any time. Caden Ellis like a blur. Sure what happened with the protection here because nobody blocked Ellis coming right through the A-gap between the guard and the center. I heard the communication up front. Justin Fields and Lucas Patrick were talking at the last second. I thought he said Lucas, Lucas, meaning go left. And so Lucas Patrick went left. Nobody was there in the right side A-gap, but I'm not... Turnovers, the issue for the Falcons this season. They give it away for the first time. Fields, great time. Along the near side, flicks incomplete out of bounds. I think this might just be a hard count and then take the delay game and punt it. Let's see. Go, go, go. They thought they caught Dupree leading. Don't see a flag. Field spins, throws. Incomplete, and there is no flag down. Look at man to man coverage. You're going to see lots of crossers, lots of outbreakers today. First and 15. Hill will keep it right up the middle. Thrown down by two.